stay in Wonderland. Welcome back, Arcade. I've got a couple of things to say. I've not done a video in a week or so, but I decided it's pretty important and uh, a strange day for the UK today. We just got a new Prime Minister, Liz Trust. I don't trust no lizard and you're about to see in a minute in this 10 minute presentation done by a call to action Ipswich it's brilliant I'm going to leave a link to his channel in the description go and check out his other work as well but this 10 minute clip has everything in it all the gematria behind it is in there as well looking at some pretty shady numbers connected to some stuff there's stuff about her being uh, MTF trans and I mean I'm not going to say it isn't the case there's a pretty good argument in this video there's loads of mad stuff surrounding this person the word trust itself we looked into that today and that's like to tie someone up or to have someone in restraints and under control kind of thing so it's not really looking good is it so I thought this needed sharing I also noticed it's Labour Day in America at the moment and uh, Labour like the Virgin Mary who you find out is a represent Liz Truss is a representative of so I presume this is connected, well of course it's connected to the Jesuits, look above the door of 10 Clowning Street. It's the same old circus, we've just got a new clown. So check out this video, peace, I'll be back soon y'all. Hello and welcome. Following the announcement of Liz Truss becoming PM, I thought it would be relevant to do a quick video on it. Nice Adam's apple there Liz. Right, let's crack on. To trust someone means to tie them up very tightly so that they cannot move. She trussed him quickly with stolen bandage and gagged his mouth. Synonyms, tie, secure, bind, strap. Looking promising, isn't it? Liz Truss supported cuts to NHS and doctors pay in think tank report. Liz Truss personally supported cuts to the NHS, arguing the service cannot be put on a pedestal. Liz Truss is unfit to be Prime Minister. Love her or loathe her, Thatcher was a formidable stateswoman and heavyweight politician who changed the course of British history. Truss is just a third-rate tribute act. Actor. In this article, it suggests, indeed, opinion polls suggest she enjoys precious little popular support outside the ranks of right-wing Tory activists. The general public preferred Penny Mordaunt to her in the early rounds of the leadership contest and Rishi Sunak in the final runoff. Just 21% like her, according to YouGov, a mere 12% think she will make a good or great Prime Minister. This is Liz Truss in Gematria, and that's 44 and 55, so let's talk about that. Properties of the number 55 represent a divine person, according to Abeleo. According to R. Allendy, it represents the individual life confused with the cosmic life Ratios of the life on the whole to the life of that part in the individuality, 5 plus 5 equals 10. Represent the limit of the humanity according to E. Bindle, representative number of the Virgin Mary. Isn't Liz Truss's middle name Mary? I know it's biblical, but it's Masonic and everything. However... Part of the meaning of the number 44 comes from Jesus' earthly ministry. Jesus was crucified and killed on Wednesday, April the 5th in 30 AD. He appears after being resurrected eight times to different sets of people. His ninth and last appearance in the flesh takes place on Thursday, May the 18th. On this day, he gives his final instructions to his disciples and then ascends to God's right hand period between his crucifixion and his ascension is 44 days. Herod Agrippa I, grandson of Herod the Great, rules over Galilee and Perea as Roman Tetrarch, starting in 39 AD. Two years later, he is declared king of Judea. In 44, he decides to have James, one of the original 12 disciples, and brother of the Apostle John, put to death. Moving on, Herod, witnessing how much it pleased the Jews to persecute Christians, arrests Peter, an angel, however, miraculously frees Peter from prison. Later in 44, Herod gives a speech to ambassadors from Tyre and Sidon. His oration is lauded with the crowd shouting that he spoke like God. 
Failing to reject the praise and give the true God glory, Herod is killed by the angel with the Lord who allows him to be eaten by worms and perish. So a lot of death references uh, with 44 so far. Verse 44 of Daniel 2 makes the glorious announcement that God's kingdom will come to the earth after mankind's final attempt to rule himself fails miserably. Hmm. It will subdue all the human-based kingdoms that came before it. It will be governed by Jesus Christ, who will righteously rule with the aid of resurrected saints. The kingdom, unlike all those that came before it on earth, will last forever. Yeah, uh, we know that's going to be fake, don't we? Because everything's fake. So um, do not be fooled by anything if anything like this happens. The fourth book of the Bible, the book of Numbers, contains 1,288, or 400 plus 400 plus 400 plus 44 plus 44 verses. It is 44 times more shorter than 3 times 444, or 666 plus 666. Also, the Vatican occupies 44 hectares in the city of Rome. Right, it's not looking good, is it? Right, so it's not looking good for you at the moment, Liz Trust. We all know somebody who laughs like this, don't we? Ha 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 ha, to get you all on side and everything. Uh, anyway, let's get, let's get into the Liz Trust being an MTF. Cause it is 